Hello everybody, Hebrew Lantern here for more Let's Play uh, The Walking Dead. Last time we uh, made it onto the ranch and uh, d did a little bit of chores, got shot at by some hicks, and almost died. Actually, we did die once, and uh, I rectified the mistake immediately, and uh, yeah, anyways, uh, today let's uh, find out why all those guys were shooting at us with arrows. It was really weird and unexpected. But yeah, anyways, let's find out what, that, what the hell that was all about. Talk to uh, the, what was his name, John? I think his name is John. Lee, what's wrong? You tell me. Uh, uh, it was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? The bandits here on our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out, but goddamn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark. Oh my god, what happened? He got <laughs> shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. He got a I paper cut. What the fuck does it look out. like? Oh no, honey, come on. Brenda's got you. <laughs> come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. <laughs> we were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. When was uh, the last payment? John, Carly said this place was locked down tight. It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no yeah. way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? The South are? will rise They're again. They're pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Ugh. Why do we have to go bandits? there? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Yes, not we safe. can. This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need oh, to do think is find can? a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, <laughs> cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown so out. So first they're uh, trying to kill us because there's the, the ambush, and now they're nice friends. people? You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, <laughs> that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while oh, you nice. were out. Hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings. <laughs> Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Aww. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? It's yeah. kind of sweet. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. <laughs> it's kind of awesome. Take a look at the Jenny. Can you go a little any faster, dude? That thing keeps a fence electrified. I want to know why the hell the fence turned on. Oh, no. Take a look at the uh, gas cans, I They're guess. Storing gasoline all over the property. Hmm. That's going to end badly, I bet. Definitely tell they built this thing themselves. Hey, it looks nice. Don't judge. Saw board. I'll bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. Hmm. Pointy. That's going to be a plot point later, I think. Maybe. Probably. It's 
to take a look at the barn. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Look at the hay bales. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just clicking around, Lots guys. Hay. Uh, enough of these might work as adequate cover for marrows, if that becomes a problem. <laughs> All right, then. Nothing over here. Let's put the hay pile. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Hmm. Let's uh, talk to Lily, I guess. See what she asked this bitch about today. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Shut the fuck How you up. Bring us to this place. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way <laughs> here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? I mean, who is? Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Yes, it is what well, we need right now. Hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. So? Shut the fuck up. Hey. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. Jesus, I'm not talking to you. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his and shoulder. And we'd all be starving. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how <laughs> he is. So, he's the asshole. Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... He's got a lot of pain. He's so, through everyone so much. does. Everyone has. Lost pretty much everything. Everyone and it's has. him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes Who do we have? Ways. So yeah, he's probably going to keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. Jesus don't Christ. judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. I'm not judging you. And I love him. I'm judging him because he's the asshole. Think a little arrangement with them was a good idea? Yes. I'd like to be asking that now. Oh my okay. god, I'm that's not talking right. to you. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. I say we say. Um, no, let's not be hasty. I'm going to go check things out. Oh my god, Just this guy is so fickle. Nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. I'll be cool. You're just being a jerk. I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. <laughs> I'm recording this at, uh, shit, it's fucking late, 2.40 a.m. I've been, uh, playing, uh, Paper Mario. <laughs> it's pretty fun so far. I'm, uh, right at the beginning, and I was like, you know what? I want to record some more Walking Dead, because I haven't recorded much. Well, I've got a few episodes in the bank, but, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I, I wanted to record another one that I could, uh, just render Fellas. while I play. You know. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it yeah, was. Yeah, you should have. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. 
Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. <laughs> Language, some son. Of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're <laughs> nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's go. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Alright, sounds good. Clem, stay here. And before we go any further, uh, next time we're gonna next time on uh, Let's Play The Walking Dead, we'll see how this reconnaissance mission goes. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a great day.